Okay guys, welcome back to the channel. So, I thought I would show you uh, me transplanting my uh, cactus fruit. So, I decided to spray paint these um, black, so you can see them here. And you can uh, check out the video of me uh, making these if you haven't already seen it, you probably have. But if you haven't, you can check the building these. Um, they're pretty good so far. So you can see, I started putting the dirt in down here. And so you can see the pipes here and the dirt kind of holds it um, together there. So you can see it's a little shaky, but once I get more dirt in here and transplant them, um, I think it'll do really good. Um, so I'm going to do two of these. I have six plants, so I'm going to put two in the, the smaller part and four in that uh, bigger part there. Um, I have these two, which are the same variety, so I'm going to put them both in this smaller part and then uh, put the other ones over in that one. So I am going to get to it. Okay, so I got these two in, and I'm going to fill around here with more dirt. Um, that was a little bit tricky getting them out of the pots, and I kind of separated the roots, which I think is okay. Um, and then I'm going to put the four over here. I'm going to put these four right here. So, and you can see this one is all branching out like crazy, which I think until they get up to the top, you kind of want to, to keep just one going up. But uh, we'll see how that works. I don't. I kind of hate to trim those off. But I think that's probably for the best. Um, drop down in the comments and let me know. Is it is it best to trim off all but one of these until you get to the top? Um, some of you might know that. Um, so I'm going to put them in here. Um, I'm going to put four in here. And I forgot to mention. You also want to put um, dirt down here. I didn't put dirt down here. And it needs dirt down there to keep the bottom weighted down a little bit better. So just wanted to uh, show you that. I'm going to get to uh, putting these um, these four in this big pot, and we'll see in a little bit. Okay, so I got these four in. You can see, got them in there. Tried to position them where I wanted them. Um, I'll have to make sure and mark them because I had to take the tags out. i got to make sure so I don't lose the varieties. Um, you can hear the guinea in the background. Sounds pretty upset that I'm out here in its territory. Um, so... I got those down. Um, let me know in the comments what you think. Um, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe. Keep up with me. And uh, the chickens and guineas are really loud in the background. And check out the other video of me making these. Make sure to do that. And uh, thanks for watching. I guess I'm going to close out this uh, video because pretty much I'm just going to be putting dirt around here. And you all don't need to see that, but I will make sure and keep you up to date. I'm going to need to buy some uh, plant uh, strapping to keep these going up the post. Some people will put a fabric around here. I don't think I'm going to. I'm just going to let it go up. Uh, but anyways, thanks for watching and uh, God bless.